Hey everyone, thanks for joining me. Today we're going to play Virtua Cop 2. Following on from Virtua Cop 1 I played recently uh, using the PS2 Elite Edition. I'm playing it on a PS2 um, using an actual disc, it's unmodified. And uh, I'm using the same just standard settings that I used uh, last time when I played Virtua Cop 1. So the difficulty is set to normal. But I increased the lives to the max to nine and I put continues on free play just to make sure I can reach the end of the game. Um, but everything else is as default. I've already calibrated the gun. Um, and that's what those settings look like there. So let's just go straight into Virtual Cop 2. I'll just point out that I do also have the game on Dreamcast, but at the moment it's easier for me to be able to record uh, PS2 footage right now because that's just what I've got set up after the last uh, last PS2 video I made. Oops, this is awkward. I've got to press start at this point. Trigger everywhere else in the menus, but to actually start the game is the start button. So as before, as in Virtual Cop, it looks like we've got three files, three stages to play, and I'll just start with the first one. And I'm using a GunCon 2. No, no third party gun here, just the, the, the authentic Namco Gun Con 2 or G Con 2 that uh, is really the official gun for use with the Sony PlayStation 2. And uh, in my opinion, probably the best gun to use with the PS2. Let's go! Let's go. I always thought this stage was pretty slow moving. Um, I'm not used to Virtua Cop games. They're relatively new to me. But I have played a little uh, VC2 uh, over the over time, but not a lot. I'm more of a time crisis as the dead guy. So this movement does seem a little slow to me. But maybe this is just the beginning of the game and uh, it'll pick up in time. Got him. I don't know if you get like, extra points for streaks. Hoping so. I think I missed the guy that was running there. Oh, did I get him? I think I got him. I think some of the scenery is destructible as well. I think if I shoot at glass cabinets, they smash. I don't know about the chandelier, but... Oh, I was going to say, I didn't want to ruin my kill streak if, uh, if I am gonna benefit from it but I missed and that's the, one of the problems with this game these games is that the camera suddenly moves abruptly just when you've lined up your shot excellent 86 percent accuracy that's really good for me no civilians hit for a change right, what have we got here looks like a big chase can i shoot the driver the tires out. I don't know. I don't think I can get the drive. Right, I think my accuracy is going to be a lot lower in this one. Oh, that's a hostage. I don't want to shoot him. Get out of the way. I think I hit the, uh, I think I hit the civilian in the car. Oops. Well, that's an end to that chase. Come on. 
show me someone. Windows. Guarantee is going to be some civilians waving their hands in the window. Some. Oh, there's one. I'm just trying to see if I could uh, shoot some of those panels out of the way. I don't, I don't think you can. No, I shot the civilian. Again. Good job, I missed him. Shoot the signboard and choose your way. Right, do I want to go downtown or Seaside Drive? Let's go downtown. I wonder, is that the selection for the next file or is that just the next part of this file? Okay, looks like we're in the car again. I've got 57% accuracy. Goodness. Yes, I missed him. To be honest, shooting all those civilians really didn't do me any favours. Didn't really have much leeway here. Definitely can't shoot that driver. One of them got me. <clears throat> Still think this game is pretty slow moving. We've stopped. I'm gonna shoot that box. Exploding barrel. I knew there was an and explode. First one I knowingly encountered in this game. Oh, I got hit. Maybe I should have waited for someone to appear before I did that. Am I going to get a chance to get that gun? Did I? No, I can't get it. No! <laughs> I ran out of bullets. I shot a civilian, I can't believe it. 
don't let me loose with a real gun. Missed him. It's two credits I've used now. Well, two continues. Technically, it's my third credit, isn't it? Oh, did I hit that civilian? Didn't see him. Looks like a boss. Where are you looking? I'm over here, cop. barrel won't explode until he's released it. Well, lucky there. him done. A bit worried I wouldn't be able to blow up that car with my little hand pistol. I killed two civilians in that. That's a shame. Their sacrifice will not be in vain. Oh, okay, so that choice I made earlier had, um, was, was a choice for the first stage. Cool. All right, let's go to file two. Save the mayor. Save the mayor. What kind of trouble has he got himself into this time? Let's hope he's worth saving. Year 39. Let's go. Who are you talking to? There's nobody with you. Destroy the helicopter. Oh, I missed it. Can't believe I missed it. I don't think I can destroy that. Was that a civilian? I guess it was. I'm a bit hesitant now to shoot people running because they might be civilians. Oh, goodness. Let's do this again. That's my third continue, I think.
Who's flying the helicopter? There's <laughs> nobody in it. Almost pulled the trigger on him. Ah, this is bad. Pace has picked up a little bit. Keep it. Oh. I should have reloaded when that guy popped his head up. that sign. Okay, I shot one civilian. So I might say that's one too many. Deck or bridge? Let's go deck. Let's keep doing the left ones uh, for this playthrough. And maybe I'll do another playthrough, perhaps on the Dreamcast, um, doing the alternate pathways. So if I just stick with all the left side ones on this one, then I know next time I should do the right hand side. Disappointing missed that. Worried that I'd. Oh no. I was a bit worried that I'd hit that civilian. Or I wouldn't have enough time. Can't shoot those crates.
Oh, he just ran right in front of the guy I needed to shoot. Fortunately, I didn't hit him. I did hit the gangster. Get that one in time. Missed him. Help me. A bit more gun. Right, looks like we got a, I suppose this is a boss battle. Doing very well. Cleared stage two. It's a bit of a disappointment that I lost the credit doing it, but that was that was quite a lot of work for my uh, poor little and a little bit sore after that one. But now we're down to file three, which is the last one, I think. Let's see what that looks like. A looks like a train. Rail line shootout. There you go. It is a train. While we're waiting for this to load, why don't you take a minute to uh, like the video and subscribe if you feel so inclined. It would be really nice to uh, to um, see a couple more subscribers on my channel. Uh, and ring the bell if you want to get notifications in the future. Are making away with the bomb in the subway. Roger. If you have any ideas of games that you'd like to see me play in the future, then please leave a comment. Let me know your experiences playing this game. Um, it would be great to have a little chat about about um oh my god sorry i can't talk and shoot at the same time but yeah let me know what you think about this game you know if you've played it before or if you haven't and uh yeah it'd be, it'd be fun to hear from you he's a civilian right
Now, this makes me think of um, Time Crisis 2. There's a train scene in Time Crisis 2. And in Confidential Mission, there's a level that's through a train. Maybe it's obligatory to have a train um, train shootout in light gun games. Um, I think Lupin the Third, the shooting, has a train level as well. Actually, it might even be the first level in there. I'm not aware of when in House of the Dead, but who knows? I haven't really played anything after House of the Dead 3. But I suppose then it would be called Train of the Dead, I suppose, wouldn't it? That would be something. Train of the Dead. Any of you uh, light gun devs out there? Make a game called Train of the Dead, please. <laughs> oh, this is giving me confidential mission vibes now. We're on the top of the train. <laughs> There's no point shooting the helicopter, is there? I'm not going to blow it. I think I got him? Yeah? I didn't see him there. <laughs> is this the front of the train? I think it is. Oh, not only did I miss, overcompensated to the left, then I shot the civilian anyway. That cost me two lives. Error. machine gun so I'm going to use it. Virtual Fighter 4. Right, run out of shots. This probably would have been a useful spot to have the machine gun. It's all right. Green Hill. Are we going to go and see Sonic the Hedgehog? <laughs> I really want to, but I did say I would do only the left routes in this playthrough. So next playthrough, we'll see if we can find and kill Sonic the Hedgehog in Green Hill Zone. But meanwhile, blue line it is. <laughs> Gosh, if Sonic the Hedgehog was a boss in Virtual Cop, that would be amazing. Or maybe it'd be Dr. Robotnik. time. The train's moving about a lot as well. I thought the movement of the game was bad enough on its own, but the train as well. It's not very helpful. Oh, too slow. of scene two. Okay, where are we now? And some tunnels. Service tunnels, maybe? Oh, 
the other guy no, didn't come back out again. Maybe that's him. <laughs> it did work. I got him, but I didn't get that alive. Oh, I don't think I'm going to be able to get it again. Fast. I don't think that life's still going to be there, is it? No, we're not turning that way anyway. Oh, he's dead. Missed him. Is there a chance that I might come across a civilian in this level? Should have done that first. Uh, could have got more for one. Oh, no time to get that shot off. <laughs> okay. Well, I've, I've lost count of how many credits I've used. Reload, reload. I've reloaded. No, that ain't doing anything. the tank I think. Hold your fire. Why am I not shooting? I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do here. Shoot the arms? Health has gone down, so I'm guessing I'm doing something right. Shoot the man in it. I think that does. That would. Uh, if it was real life, it would. No. There we go. Oh, he's got more health. So he had a full health bar, but it only took like one or two hits again. I think that might be the end of the game. Stop the airship. Oh no, bonus file four. Excellent. I love it when it's a bonus. Should only take a moment to load up. Like I said, it's running off a disc on an unmodified PS2, so sometimes it takes a minute. This is me. Hold my fire. I'm trying to shoot, but I never hear what they say. Maybe it's like a repeat, repeat kind of boss battle mashup kind of thing. So only one of these guys instead of. Five or six. Oh. I'm 
not getting my reloads in properly. He's down. Anyone else? No? Congratulations. I guess that's it. Unless there's a file 5. <laughs> if that was file 4, it was very quick. This looks like an ending. Yeah, we got some credits. Nice. So I, that's more Virtual Cop 2 than I've ever played before. Previously, I've only played up to, I think, the end of the first car chase in the first stage. I think the reason for that is because I was playing it on a Raspberry Pi in a Dreamcast emulator, and I wasn't convinced that it was playing at the correct speed, so I wasn't enjoying it. So um, at least now I'm playing it on actual hardware on PlayStation 2. Um, I'm satisfied that what I played was the real experience, even if it wasn't arcade. <laughs> Everyone all gets into a car at <laughs> the end. He, th these other two guys, they've just appeared. I've done all the dirty work, now they turn up to take some of the credit. I know it's a two-player game and you can play as one of the other guys as player two as well, but... <laughs> Maybe they should have done a slightly separate ending for a single player game. But still, that was a great game. I really enjoyed that. Crime Buster. Rank four. Actually, that was a lot better. A lot better rank than I got when I played through Virtua Cop 1. I think I got rank nine. All right, let's put my name in. Which, there we go. Top of the leaderboard. Nicely done. <laughs> so... I've, I've played through that. I realized there are some choices that you can make to go to alternate sections. So I will play through it again. And I think next time I play it, I'll play it on a Dreamcast version and I'll take those second uh, root choices when I do that. But that's all I'm going to do for today. We'll do something else in the next video. And uh, if you liked it, please press the like button. If you are so inclined, please subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And if you want to get notifications about more of my videos in the future, then hit the bell button. Please leave a comment if you enjoyed it. And um, I'll see you again next time. Thank you very much. Goodbye.